Are you tired of spending hours trying to create your social media content? Well, what if I told you you can create 30 social media posts in minutes? Well, stick around because I'm gonna show you how you can use Canva to create 30 social media posts in minutes so that you can save a ton of time and also save your sanity. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Hey there coaches and creators, Brittany here and welcome to the Template Society channel where we help coaches and creators to easily create content using templates. Now before we dive into today's topic, I definitely want you to check out a free content calendar that I have for you that will help to make creating your social media posts and scheduling it and knowing what to say so much easier. You can find out more about it below and also don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Oh, I'm so excited to dive into this because you're gonna be able to create your post really quick. So the first thing I want to do is take you behind the scenes on how we can get familiar with creating our content using Canva's AI feature. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to where it says doc. We're going to click on start writing and now we are taken to an actual area where we can start to plug in copy to create for our social media posts. Maybe you're creating reels or Instagram posts, Facebook posts, whatever it may be, but ultimately Canva AI will help you to at least come up with the content so that you know exactly what you want to say and how to say it. Now we are going to act as if we are a social media coach. And so I'm going to plug in some information into Canva so it can help to generate some content that we can use for our posts. Okay, let's go ahead and go to plus. And what we're going to do is go to where it says magic, right? I'm going to click on magic, right? Okay. Then it's going to say, add a voice. So you can add a voice if you would like, if you don't have one, maybe you're just getting started with Canva and utilizing its AI features. You can either go and add this in or you can just see what it provides you. So let's go ahead and hit generate. What I typed in was you're a social media coach and you want to share 30 tips, um, strategies or motivation with your audience in social in a social media post. So I'm going to go ahead and click generate and let's see what it comes up with. Okay, so while this is generating, it's really important for you to also go through each of the text um, and information and paragraphs and all that great stuff to ensure that it's in alignment with your business and what you would say. So again, AI is not always correct, and that's why it's important for you to use your years of experience or your knowledge and your expertise. So go through, add in your voice, add in your expertise, things that AI does not necessarily have, and make sure that it is in alignment with your business. So so now it has provided me with a ton of stuff. So here's a list of 30 social media tips, strategies, and motivational quotes to inspire and guide your audience. So let's go ahead and insert this. Okay, now that you know how to use Canvas AI feature to create content, I want to walk you through how you can create designs so that you can quickly create your posts. But wait, there's a twist. I wanna show you how to make your designs even more effective and create the design with ease without having to start from scratch. So let me show you that real quick. We wanna show you what's inside the Template Society membership. So in our membership, we have tons of designs, email templates, captions, and all that great stuff to help you to create your social media and create any other type of content you need in your business. So you will see a ton of different types of templates that can assist you. But here's what I really want to show you is our design library. So since we're talking about how to create social media posts, we have tons of camera design templates that are already designed for you. And all you have to do is just plug in your text and maybe change up your colors and your fonts and you are good to go. So let's take a peek at some of our uh, social media graphics that you can use, which can help you to quickly create your content for 30 days. So we have several different types of templates and all you would have to do is hit access your template and then you are able to use this in Canva, plug in your content and there you go. You are now able to share this with your audience in minutes. So this is just another quick tool that can help to save you time and also be a full collection when you are creating your actual content for social media. So come and check it out. Okay, let's get back to the tutorial. Okay, now we're going to move into step two, which I'm going to show you how to quickly design your posts. But here's one thing I want you to know. It does not have to be a headache to create your designs in Canva. You can make this a smooth process. All we have to do is create a template and be able to tweak it and change it throughout. Okay, so let me show you how to create these designs and templates and posts so that you can quickly create your social media. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and figure out what posts we want to use first. So let's just say Instagram Reels. So I'm going to type in Instagram Reels 
and let's go ahead and start with a blank slate. And what we're going to do is we're gonna hop over to the design area if you're not using our template society membership. So let's go ahead and go to design. Now we can scroll and see some of the different templates that Canva has. So I wanna make sure that my graphics are on point and connect with the text that I've created. So I'm gonna to go to social media and we're gonna look for things that have to do with social media. So we're gonna use this particular template. Let's go ahead and click on this and let's also create multiple. Okay. So now what we have going on is we basically have a whole reel from Canva. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit play. You can kind of see what it has going on right now. And we are going to plug in that content that we just recently created with Canva's uh, AI feature. So let's go ahead and grab that content. So what we're going to do Let's go over here. So the first thing that we had is consistency is key. So we're gonna hop over here and you can say four things you need to do to be successful with uh, social media. So we typed in four things you need to succeed at social media as a coach or a creator. So now what I'm gonna do is I can basically change these images up or I can keep them as is. There is already a video. It already looks like she's talking on, or on social media. So I'm just gonna leave that as is. Now I'm gonna go to the first step. I'm gonna go and grab that content. First one is going to be consistency is key. I'm going to just copy and paste that. Let's just say everything looks good. So I'm going to copy and paste that over. So let's go ahead and paste and let's get rid of that. We're going to make the text a lot larger. X. Here we go. Okay. Consistency is key. Let's remove these. Okay. Let's make this a lot larger. Again, we want to make sure everyone can see it. And you can obviously change this to be in your brand. So whatever your brand font is, um, you can change that, all of that good stuff. We're gonna make this the seasons. Okay, and again, you can change it to your colors, all of that to where it definitely is in alignment with your brand. I'm just gonna change this color. We're gonna make this pink. I'll make it even lighter. I'm gonna change all the text to green. Okay, and now you can see that there are some additional things happening here. So really great site, really great site. You wanna change that. So go through and remove, you can remove it or change it or add in your content. So now that we have that, we can now hop to the next thing. So again, you can change these photos out, but if you wanna leave them as is, that's totally fine too. Okay, so now let's go to the second one. Let's go to know your audience. Okay, so the third one, we're gonna go ahead and just plug in. Again, we're gonna continue this process so that we can plug in our content. So let's go ahead and get the quality over quantity. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is, now that we created our actual reels, plugging in that information that we received from Canva, I'm gonna see what it looks like as a whole. So here, look, here it is. So this is how you can quickly create these types of posts. So you can, again, duplicate this and continue to make multiple posts with the same type of um, template, or you can see some of the other designs, but the goal is not to create too many different designs. So now that you know how to create your designs, now we're going to create this for a different type of platform using the same design. So let's go ahead and hit resize. And what we're going to do is we are going to turn this into an Instagram post instead of a reel. So let's go ahead and hit Instagram post. This feature is going to be used on Canva Pro. So if you don't have Canva Pro, I highly recommend you use it. It can truly help you in your business, especially as you're creating content. Okay, so let's go ahead and hit Instagram post. Let's hit continue. And then Canva's gonna give me two options. I can go to copy and resize, or I can go to resize this design. I'm gonna go ahead and hit copy and resize because we wanna save and preserve the reels and posts and TikTok things 
things that we just created and we want to create a new post so that we can use for more of um, more of a static type of post or like an Instagram. So here is the resize. So this is what it came up with. And now what we can do to really ensure that this fits more of the uh, sizing of what we just created and also is more in alignment, we can get rid of the video. So let's go ahead and go to images. Let's just type in social media image. Um, I'm gonna just type in social media images or social media and I'm gonna go to photos and let's see what it has. So instead of using this video for the actual post, I'm gonna go ahead and change this to be something else. And I'm going to, again, just update all of these other images. Let's grab this particular image instead and anything else that makes sense and goes in alignment with your actual image. So let's grab this one. Now I have changed the images. Let's go ahead and grab one more. Okay, now that we have actually changed the images, and again, now this is going to work better for our actual Instagram post, um, we can use the same thing. We can even use this. Um, we don't have to necessarily have the numbers on it. Maybe we wanna post one thing at a time, so quality over quanti quantity, and we share more in the actual captions. So this just came up with basically, um, let's just say, cause this is not gonna count. So we're going to create we created basically four pieces of content by just resizing that. So we're going to do this for all of the text that we have already generated. And this can be done really quickly. So as you could see, I was able to create basically four pieces of content in just a couple of minutes. And now we can do this for each of the different pieces of content. So we can create 30 pieces of content really quick. And then you can go back to Instagram um, post blank, just because you can find what you're looking for easier. And let's go to design and type in social media. Now, when we type in social media, here are some different, um, just different style of posts that Canva provides. So let's say we wanted to do something more along the lines of, let's find something that we can change, maybe something like this. So here is another post that you can create. Again, since we have a ton of just different tips and strategies, you can go and grab some of this information. So stay true to brand and then copy and paste this into this section. And then you can provide more information about how to stay true to your brand consistency. So you can go and do that for each of these different sections. Again, change them to be more on brand. So you can change these colors, all that great stuff. But our main goal is to find templates that work that we can use over and over again versus having to sit and create a new design every single time we want to create a post. So now that we have created our Canva AI, we also have basically created our Canva posts and we also uh, know how to resize. We are are now ready to share our posts with our audience and also plug in our preferred captions, which again, you can use Canva AI to help you to create those captions as well. Okay, I can't wait to see what you create, but ultimately you can create 30 pieces of content really quick without having to start from scratch and you can use it on multiple platforms. Okay, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and check out that content calendar that I have for you that can help to make social media scheduling so much easier because you know what to say, what to post, and so much more. You can find that in the link below and I'll see you next time. Thanks so much for tuning in to today's episode. If you're hungry for more and want to learn more insights to help you with your content creation process, definitely check out this video right here so that you can be able to execute a content strategy that works effectively, allows you to engage and generate more sales.